Here's the starting 11 for Sweden. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And here's the starting 11 for South Africa. Well, the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the fullback and winger, and of course the centre-backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. And space to cross it. To jump in front. And she's kept it out. Can she find the right pass? Must take the lead here. Oh, good work by the keeper. Now, what can they do from here? It has to be! And a goal! That will do it! They've been pushing for it, and now they've been rewarded! Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. Moving forward effectively. Can they square the game? And a goal to square the game. Edge of the seat stuff. Well, just look at this again. Great technique, good accuracy, and enough power to beat the keeper. That's an excellent goal. And space to attack. Real chance. Was an important piece of defending. How about the cross? Oh, good use of the ball. Can they forge ahead? Keeper had work to do. Terrific block. Can they forge ahead from this corner kick? Let's see. Over it comes. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Decent position. Could cross it in here. Can they take the lead? Well, just narrowly wide of the post that time. Well, they're certainly thinking about a winner. Could be. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here.
Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. And players waiting in the centre. Just cutting off the supply. And we've entered the final five minutes. And what an opportunity this is for her. Well, that's really... In it goes! She snaps up the second chance. Frustration for the goalkeeper. Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately, it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. And there goes the final whistle. It goes into the history books as a win for them. So, morale is high. Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield, and they created chances as well. It was a great performance.